Hello, I'm going to show you some tips and tricks when using this resource in Seesaw as a student. You might have different questions or shapes than me, but that's okay. This is just an example to show you how things work. You can change the size of your screen by using the magnifying glass and the plus and minus tool right here. If the tools are distracting you, you can take them away with this tool. To get them back, click on the pencil. To move the shapes onto your workspace, click the three dots over here. Then, Shapes. Scroll on your computer or swipe up on your tablet to find the shapes that you need. Click on the shape that you like to add it to your workspace. To get rid of the shape selection, click on a blank spot on your workspace. You can move shapes by clicking on the shape you want to move and drag it to the spot. You can turn shapes by using the floating dot above. I like to call this the doorknob because doorknobs turn things just like this doorknob does. The other little dots are stretchy dots. They make shapes bigger and smaller. If you make a small mistake, you can use the undo and redo buttons up here at the top. If you make a big mistake, click on the shape that you don't like, then the three dots below, then the trash can. Or if you have a keyboard, click on the shape you don't like, then backspace or delete on your keyboard. To type in the answer, click inside of this box, Hit delete on your keyboard and type in your final answer. When you're finished with this question, you will see the baby slides on the side or down below. Click on the next slide and try the next challenge. I hope this helped. Good luck and have fun.